Hello friends and welcome of you on this course the creation of a web application a website using Spring Boot now in this course we will learn how to build a complete website from scratch and at the end of the course you will be able to create a full website that is functional with database now for the back end I will use the Spring Boot, the JPA framework, and the database I will use uh, both PostgreSQL and MySQL for uh, user logins or uh, user registrations. Uh, I will make the database in both ways so you could have the option that is suitable for your need. Uh, I will also use a Java mail service. Now for the front end, I will use a time leaf template the grid CSS which will give us a good control over uh, the layout design and I will use some uh, jQuery and we will create and we will get a responsive design that is fit for the desktop tablet or a smartphone now I will show you this is the website that I have built for my own cell using these uh, techniques now this is few web pages contains few web pages uh, with social networks with uh, login form using a recapture for security a registration page a forgot password in case you forgot or your client forgot his password he can reset it again and also this website is can fit for any size <coughs> or any this device so as you can see here this is the website now that fits for smartphone as you can see using the grid CSS we will able to customize it to fit for a smartphone or you can use it as a desktop version now uh, I will use the uh, build on operating system that is Ubuntu 18 and I'm using the GDK 1.8 this will enable you to uh, compile later on if you have uh, want to compile on a GDK 11 12 or 13 this will be possible for you the design basically consists of two parts the backend part which consists of the controllers the spring boot application and the DAO the modules the services everything we will add in here and the other part which is the uh, user interface which we will use uh, templates and all the CSS the J J queries all these we will create in here for the images for JavaScript and uh, for the templates that we will create the HTML <coughs> template and we will <coughs> add the application properties which I will show later from where you can get and of course the messaging properties the messages properties that we can add for any HTML page now at the end of this course hopefully you will be able to build a full responsive website that is suitable for your need or your clients needs I hope you will enjoy this course and I hope you will be benefiting from it and I thank you for the subscription thank you very much